Hello, welcome back to another vlog. I'm just waiting for my sister to get out of the car, but we are at Chapters in there. I'm so excited. It's obviously Christmas and everything is done. I'll talk to you all about that later because I had started Vlogmas and then I just kind of stopped the last three days. I did film on the 23rd, but then I was too lazy to um, edit on the 24th. And then on the 24th, I just wanted to honestly sit, watch Christmas movies all day before. Um, hold on. Are my keys? Yeah, I do. Um, I just wanted to watch Christmas movies literally all day, so that's what we did. And then on um, Christmas Day, I just had no energy to vlog. I was also working on Christmas Eve, so I wanted to watch movies before I went to work. But anyways, I'm so excited to go to Chapters and I will take y'all along. It's already so excited. <laughs> This is what happens to us every single time we're struggling to decide what we're actually gonna buy and not buy. And this is how much she's bought. We got so much stuff. <laughs> we decided to come to Boston Pizza randomly for lunch, not planned. We were gonna go to Cactus, even that was not planned. And we're like, no, we have a gift card, so we're gonna use the gift card. <laughs> so now, show your face. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're just gonna eat here. Um, I do have work tonight, so I'm cutting it very short with like in terms of resting and stuff, but it's okay. I also just want to enjoy my life, so I'm so excited to eat. It's already one o'clock and I'm so hungry. We got the seven cheese ravioli. We just got one and they actually put it in two separate plates so that we could just, because I told them we were gonna share it, so that was really nice of them to just put it in two separate plates. And then we got the jalapeno dip, which is like a holiday special. I think they might keep it though because it's been doing really good. This dip tastes so good, but it always comes with cactus cuts and I asked them if they could replace it with um, the pizza bread instead and they did. So this is my first time going to be trying it with the pizza bread. Otherwise I always get it with the cactus cuts and I'm so excited. I think this is a better option for us. It's more filling definitely with the pizza bread. But I'm so hungry. I can't wait to eat. Last but not least, we also ended up getting some dessert. We're back home now and I was about to go take a nap right away because I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so tired when I was sitting there. It's nap time, it's nap time. But now I'm like, I'm just gonna, like all of a sudden I got home and I have this random energy and I'm like, I'm just gonna nap in a little bit. But I wanted to do this quick little haul right now instead of doing it later. So. Let me show you everything that we got from Indigo. More like most of the stuff that my sister bought, but I'm gonna show you anyways. One second. First thing is just this book. It's for my sister's class, school, or whatever, so that's not a big deal. Um, I got this for Pavin. That's her name, my perceptor, who I always say is my perceptor, who's not my perceptor for Pavin, um, I got her this little notebook. It says simplicity is the ultimate form of sophistication. She just finished her um, like real estate course a little while ago. She's a nurse, full-time nurse, has been working as a nurse for like 10 years. And now she did um, real, like she did the real estate course and now she's a realtor as well. So um, I got her this cute little gift, which I'll show you after. I got it made off of Etsy. I'm going to give it to her tonight because I'm working with her tonight. So it arrived just in time. I'm going to give her that. But I was like, I'll also throw this in because I found it there. And I was like, this is actually like her kind of aesthetic. Because um, I might be too big for her. I don't know. But I feel like she must have, you know, she's probably going to need a notebook or something. So it is a really big, nice notebook. And I just, I think the colors are really nice. I think she'll like the colors. That's why I got her that. Um and then also indigo had like a really good sale right now because it's boxing week sale and then also um my sister has the plum reward so we get like an additional whatever percent off so they had like a really really good deal and stuff so i also found her this this wasn't really on sale we just got the 10 percent off with my sister's plum thing but 
Um, I only got this for her as well because this is like definitely her like style um, because on her Instagram page it's like all black and white and I know she likes neutrals like we've had this conversation if you're watching yeah I know um, so I was like that's perfect because it's black and white and then it has like this nice gold handle which isn't obviously too flashy or anything like that so I hope she likes it. I was like, you know, she can have her morning coffee as she's like doing her work on her laptop, on her work desk, that sort of thing. So I went with that theme. So I decided to get her this as well. I thought it was really cute. This one wasn't on sale, but I just liked it. I thought it was like meant for her. And then I got myself a mug too. The so the mug, that I got, the mug that I got for myself was actually on sale. It was only $7.50 and it's just so cute. It just says coffee down the middle right there well yeah it says coffee and it's just like white and like it just looks so aesthetically pleasing and I needed more mugs I always want like nice cute mugs but I just don't want to spend the money on them um but this was seven dollars and fifty cents on sale and then we got another ten percent off so it cost like six dollars and something so I got that for myself And then we got some more books so the first one is as good as dead we have the um good girl's guide to murder and then the other one as well um over here good girl bad blood i haven't read them yet my sister's read them so then she wanted the next one they're at home i will read them eventually i just have way too many books to read and i also read i read like hardcover books that we have at home and i also read books on my kindle so i end up reading a lot so i can't just like I just have too many books to get through basically but she got this i'm excited to read it too once i go through the other books and then she got one for her friend it's called um one of us is next so it's a sequel to one of us is lying i have heard of the book one of us is lying and i want to read it as well and then eventually i'll make my way and read this but we only bought it as like the gift because obviously we have too many books to get through still and then we got it's not summer without you because we have um the other book the summer i turned pretty so now we got this one as well um she said it was 12 dollars, so we have that book super cute it's like a really nice summer kind of read i read the summer i turned pretty in summer i just thought it was like a really nice light read and then she also got um how to be loved by humble the poet also another really nice read i'm interested in reading it too the funny thing is when i go into chapters i want to buy like half the store like literally i just it's like Candyland or like wonderland or whatever and i just get so excited like every single time we go i end up spending so much money in there because i can't help myself but today i helped myself i did not buy any books all these books she purchased but they are all books that I want to read as well. So it worked out in our favor. Like, I mean, it's not like, you know, oh, like I only buy books for myself that she can't read, nothing like that. But I'm just saying like, I didn't go in there like with the intent to like go shopping for books because she told me she had to buy a gift. And then I ended up finding things that I wanted to put in my gift. So I just got those things. But um, yeah, otherwise I like can't help myself I always have to come out with books it's just today I really stopped myself because I'm like I have so many on my kindle and I read so many books like I still have so many books at home that I'm going through so I was like I need to start going through them before I buy more but she ended up buying three more so it is what it is we're gonna read them eventually so and like I said they were having a really good sale and lastly we got two planners one is for my sister she uses some company called band dough and i use the fringe planners those are my favorite and these were 40 percent off i think or 25 percent off something like that so i don't really like the cover that much this year but i do like the fringe planners those are my favorite so then i just ended up getting this i do wish there were other styles but there wasn't really much so yeah so that's it that's all i got from indigo um i will show you guys some other stuff not you guys i will show you all some other stuff a little bit later i'm gonna try to see if i can nap for like 20 minutes or something hopefully and then when i start wrapping her gift to give her today i will show you the other stuff i woke up from my 30 minute nap and i just 
brush my teeth again because I always like to brush before I go just because I wake up so early then it's gross to like not have brushed teeth all night um I'm wearing this nurse crew neck today I'm wearing another t-shirt underneath because I get so cold um and this is from Etsy it just says nurse I'm wearing my pink um figs scrub bottoms I think I like prefer wearing crew necks and stuff with my pants now but I only have like a certain number of scrubs that I would wear I mean a certain number of crew necks that I would actually wear to work so this is one of them wearing that um and yeah that's the outfit now I thought I would just um quickly go ahead and wrap Pavin's part two of her gift on City Here's her birthday gift but our schedules literally never line up like outside of work so I haven't had time to actually meet her outside of work so I was like I'm just gonna give it to her at work that's from December 17th her birthday was December 17th so I'm gonna give her that and then I already showed you the cute little gift that I put together but what else is in there is this thing that I got me off of Etsy so I'm gonna show you that um I just need to set up my camera here okay so it comes on a stand. It's for her desk. Well, maybe for her desk if she wants to put it there. Obviously, it doesn't look like this. It's a I chose a black stand. So the sticker comes off. And then this is what's going to go on her, on the stand. It says, to my soul sister Pavan, congratulations on your new journey. I'm so proud of all the hard work you've put towards your goals. Love, Baron. And I chose the image and like, like the hair length and everything like that. And then she basically has like Louis Vuitton heels, even though she doesn't even own them. But um, I just thought they like went really well with the outfit that I chose for her um, because there was one that was actually really nice. It was like a full um, black like suit kind of design, which I thought is more her. But then her hair, because I was going to leave the hair open, it was like meshing in. So I decided to just go for a red dress and that way like everything stands out. And that, that's why I chose those shoes because I was like, just kind of like goes with the whole theme. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually, instead of just putting this in a gift bag like this, like in wrapped paper, I think I'm just going to take this off and just put it in there like this. So that when she takes it out, she can just see how it's supposed to be. Because I feel like it, is, it looks kind of funny if I just like throw these two things in there like that. So I think I'm going to do that instead. So this is it's actually my first time ordering like a customized gift like this off of Etsy. I've ordered like my crew necks and stuff before but it's actually turned out really good. Just the shipping took forever which fair enough the holiday season and the snow and everything like that. So it is what it is. Hopefully she likes it. Maybe it's the wrong way though. Yeah, this is how it's supposed to look. So yeah, it's basically that you can only put it on the desk because otherwise it wobbles around. So I guess I have to put it like this and then it just kind of leans back. And then I thought that it kind of looks nice to like put on your desk or something like that. I don't know where she wants to use it, but super cute. I actually really like it. to give it to her i hope she likes it i'm just watching emily in paris because i have like 20 minutes left before i leave and i'm just gonna drink the fair life protein tonight because we eat boston pizza really late so i'm really full from it but i also don't want to get really hungry so i'm not gonna take any food just snacks um but i thought i would at least just have a protein shake um just because i don't i'm not in the mood to have a full meal i also have to pour gas Technically, I should leave earlier, but also I could just care less. I'm so excited to get, go to work today, though, just because I'm working with all my favorite people. So it's going to be a good shift. 
um, regardless of the acuity and stuff, that's a whole other situation. It just makes it so much better when you work with people that you enjoy working with. Um, and yeah, so I'm actually really excited to go to work today, but I'm gonna chill out and get going when the time comes. Just got home from night shift. It's like 8.15 in the morning and I'm about to go to sleep. When I turn off the, I have my candle going. Um, even though Christmas is over, I have so many holiday candles. I'm trying to get through some of them. I finished these two this holiday season. Merry cookie and spiced gingerbread. And now I'm almost done the twisted peppermint. So I'm going to leave this on as I sleep. I don't sleep for that long anyway, so it's fine with the candles on. And my lights are out. Good night. I'll talk to you in a bit. I'm awake now. It's a mu like much later. Um, I've showered and all that kind of stuff. But um, I wanted to show you all this because I got this from Lululemon for Boxing Day. And this was like one of the only items I purchased during Boxing Day from Lululemon. And I have been eyeing this for so long. It was in my Christmas wish list as well. Um... But I knew it would go on sale, so it did. Still quite expensive, but I just really wanted it. Trust me, I never spend that much money on a clothing item. And I know it's not still. I feel like I could have bought it at a cheaper price. But there was just something about it that I really wanted. For some reason, I really like the color. And I don't wear colors like this. So and I ended up just buying it. I was like, you know what? I like work all these hours and stuff. Like, let me just buy something that I really want, even though it's pricey. So this is what I got on Boxing Day. And it's the um, oversized fit fleece half zip. Um, it's from the men's section. I think the color is called pomegranate. It's a size medium. And this is how it looks. I'm just wearing it with my scrubs because I was going to change into my scrubs now. But um, this is how it looks. And it's just really cute and cozy. When I first saw it, I was like, I don't know if I want to keep it. But now that I put it on, it just looks really cute. So I'm still deciding just because of price point. But I kind of really like it too. So I don't know what to do. It does have like zippered pockets, which I think is really useful and helpful. Um, and it's supposed to be like a quarter zip. I got a medium, so I like the fact that it's loose. I do, however, wish it was longer. Like I thought I was buying a longer one just because it says oversized. So I wouldn't say it's like that oversized. Um, I do wish it was like even a little bit longer. Like even if it was just like up to here, I would have loved that. So anyways, that was my Boxing Day little um, purchase. Did buy one other thing, which I'll show you either in this vlog or my next vlog. And I'm so excited. I was just so happy that I spent some money on it. So I'll show you all that either later today or in a different vlog. But anyways, just wanted to show you this. Um... And while I'm at it, actually, I might as well just do a quick other haul. I got a package from Figs. Um, this is what I purchased from Figs on Black Friday, and it didn't arrive until like two days ago. So, I got a new pair of scrubs, I'll show you the color. So here is the color it's called green moss or just moss i don't know but it's like this really nice green color i really like it it's not too dark not too bright it's like a muted green so i'm a huge fan i did order this during boxing day like i said it wasn't in my oh sorry not boxing day black friday it wasn't in my boxing day haul oh my god not boxing day it wasn't in my black friday haul because um I didn't arrive in time, but I had inserted a picture of it in my Black Friday video. These are the pants. I personally love the Livingstone Basic pants. I know people prefer joggers and everything, but I just like them because they're loose. I just like wearing loose like clothes to work. I don't like wearing like really tight pants. So I do have joggers. I do like them, but I feel like these fit me better. I'm not a big fan of the orange lace, like bright orange, but I put my scrub tops on top so it always just covers it but yeah I'm so excited I finally got this package it's just like a bunch of random hauls I thought I might as well just like I feel like this whole vlog is just me doing all these hauls of items that I have at my house because I feel like I might as well just show everything once so that I can wash and put stuff away um yeah and 
I'm gonna change out of this and then I'm gonna show you what I got for Christmas for my sister as well because I might as well just show you literally everything that's sitting at home right now. Okay, so now I'm about to show you everything that I got for Christmas. This year's Christmas was literally just a gift swap between my sister and I because we didn't celebrate. I've already talked about this in all my vlogs, um, why we didn't celebrate and stuff. Um, and just the people also that I celebrate with also aren't here. So um, it was just like literally just between my sister and I. So this is what she got me. And we also were kind of on a budget. So um, we, I like put things on my list that I like wanted but we're still in decent price point, that sort of thing. So anyways, um, I got this quarter zip from American Eagle. No, I actually, okay, wrong. I didn't put this one on my wish list. I had put a different one on my wish list from American Eagle. I spoke about it in my Christmas wish list video, the one that I put up there. But um, my sister keeps saying that it's, I was like, I put up a dress, but I didn't because I went back and checked. I was like, I didn't. It was just that those ones sold out. So they weren't even available on the site. The ones that I was looking for. The other day I did see that they're back on the site, but they're in like different colors that I don't care for. So um, yeah, they were sold out. So then she ended up getting me these quarter zips. She actually got me two. I never thought that she would get me two. So I was surprised. So I have both the colors that I wanted. Like I have an olive color and I have this like dark heathered uh not heather like dark gray like a, a washed out black sort of color um and they're just really cute and they're cozy i don't really shop at erie anymore but i don't know i just like i'm starting to get impressed by them again so i'm excited for wearing these i did try them on and they look really cute this um olive one still has this on there by mistake so i have to go back so i think we're gonna go back to the mall next week and do our exchanges and everything and then i'll get this taken off so i got those two sweaters from airy and then this was a complete shock for me because basically when we went christmas shopping i don't know what it is sorry my hair is a mess just ignore it i haven't done my hair for work yet but um when we went christmas shopping for other people I don't know why this stood out to me like I never said that I wanted it on my wish list or anything like that I was just like for some reason I just really liked it and um it's this she got me a Nike sweatsuit it wasn't on my wish list I wasn't expecting it but she gifted it to me and I'm so actually in love with it um and we realized it's actually from the men's section I didn't realize that like as I was looking at it, it was just like one of those first sweatsuits that they had at, like the very front of the store. And um, I was like, I really like it. And this one also is like, it doesn't have a HUD and it just looks so cute. I tried it on. And so like the sweater um, just looks so cute on, even if I was just to wear it with like leggings or jeans. And then these are the joggers. She got me a size small in both of them. And like I said, they're from the men's section. They fit me really well, actually. I don't wear things this bold, but I don't know why. Bold as in like, just like Nike literally everywhere. But I don't know why I like this sweatsuit so much that day when we walked in. So she ended up buying it for me and I'm actually really excited to wear it just because it looked really cute on. Um, sometimes when you get like the men's sweatpants, like sometimes the crotch area is a little weird, but this one doesn't have that. My Lululemon ones that I have make it look very obvious and I don't really like it just because it like looks a little funny, but this one doesn't because I tried it on just looks like a regular set of joggers so um yeah I'm actually really excited to wear this it is super cozy and super cute and definitely out of like my typical style so I was like okay well I'll be branching out that's for sure and then lastly I got this um flea zip up from my sister from Amazon I asked for this um, in this color just because I wear these to work all the time. I have like four of them, but I don't really like my color ones anymore. I only like to wear the black and the gray ones. So now I have another gray one to add to my collection. Um, I just like wearing these over my scrubs to keep me nice and warm throughout night shift. And yeah, that was it from that. And then my work secret Santa, I did end up getting the Lululemon belt bag. So I'm really excited. Um, it's so funny because like I said, the entire time I worked at Lululemon, I never bought one. And then as I was about to leave working for Lululemon, I wanted one, but it was sold out because I left last January. And so it was like after the holiday, so everything was sold out. Um, and so, and then I just never spent the money on it, but now I ended up getting it as my 
gift from my work please so i am so excited to use this especially in the summertime and everything you know for the hot girl walks and all that <laughs> um but yeah i finally have one so i'm super excited for that and that was it um watch my last year's video because obviously it was like a lot more fun i feel like but these are all things that i am actually really grateful for and i wanted and i'm so excited to wear so that was that um yeah now it's like i don't know 3 30 or something um i'm working my second night shift tonight i worked my two days and then um i have a third night shift tomorrow i'm bringing in the new year with um literally at my workplace i'm ringing in the new year at work so because somebody needed a shift swap so i just took that shift which is fine it's stop pay whatever um and I, I wasn't doing anything for new year's anyways i rang in christmas at work as well because i was working christmas eve so yeah that's just been my life for december and to be honest i don't even really mind it i felt like i was just very like work focused this month and yeah i wish like i had taken some time out to enjoy the holidays but also like I don't know it's been kind of nice too just working so much i like i'm trying to just get as much as i can done now um so hopefully in the next coming months i can chill out a little bit and yeah like even though literally the new year is coming in two days i haven't done anything about like actually getting my life together like my house is a mess my closet is a mess like fridge needs to be cleaned pantry needs to be cleaned need to get rid of clothes like just need a huge deep clean of the house and i haven't done any of it um i'm just gonna ring in the new year like that and then in the new year when i have some days off i'm going to do a huge deep clean in my house so i will definitely vlog that because oh, i have to get so rid of so many things in this house right now um haven't really made any plans for the new year haven't sat down worked on my goals none of that i've just been working so um i gotta get back into that gotta get back into my school routine because i'm starting to fall behind on some of my assignments and everything so i gotta get like go back and take care of that make a nice schedule work on that um and yeah so i'm just all over the place this vlog was really random i just kind of felt like vlogging because i was like okay i just gave up after like 22 days of vlogmas and then i just decided to like not post for the last three days so i was like okay i'm just gonna start this randomly and then i'll just talk about why i stopped vlogging all that kind of stuff which i already spoke about yesterday when i first started the vlog yeah i'm like all over the place but i'm gonna see you all in the new year so i will meet you in my next video in 2023 this is the last vlog of 2022 um please subscribe to my channel share this video with others just my channel with others definitely want to grow on youtube especially going into the new year so 